How did you feel when Jake was reacting in that way? Because we all cope with grief, grief in different ways. Some of us go very quiet mm. and internalise it. Jake was obviously mm. expressing it in one way. Was it something that you thought, he's, he's a good boy, I'm just going to let him ride yes. this out? Yeah. Um, I, I, I thought that it was poss possibly the best thing for Jake to do. Yeah. Um, he would lock himself away in his bedroom and write songs really moving songs that that touch everybody's heart because everybody has lost somebody in their life and yeah. um although it was very poignant to us it also meant an awful lot to people that were listening to the songs as well yeah. um he did start drinking a lot and going out a lot didn't you but um mm -hmm. i just felt that it was i know he's a good lad and mm -hmm. he he wouldn't sort of you know really go into that side of it drinking yeah. and, and becoming bad if you like because yeah. he's not a bad lad he's a good lad mm. it's, it's what's interesting as well as we know you as you're such a cheeky cheery chappy and you know and hearing that you do still have your toddler tantrums honestly <laughs> yeah. um, actually i suppose it's quite a healthy thing in a way because when you're putting on this cheery front to know that you can let it all out in front of your mum and your mum is going to go it's all right at the end of the day it's all right mm. is it do, do you do you still feel that way even if you want to give him a clip around the ear oh, I do oh, every day <laughs> Jake, you've 